hi guys welcome back to the channel if you're new welcome please subscribe and join the family you guys it's been raining sweet weddings this year and just when we thought we had seen enough the gospel minister Theophilus sunday came ringing sweet wedding bells with the love of his life ashley i know a lot of you will be wondering who is this girl who is this sister that stole our brother's heart all right i've come to give you all the tea just sit down and relax let's talk about ashley the first thing you should know is that obviously her name is ashley and on instagram she is it's ashley white secondly she's from jamaica jamaica became independent in 1962 remaining a member of the british commonwealth jamaica is located in north america and although their official language is english majority of the population speak jamaican patois. i know you are wondering will our brother even hear what they are saying yes he will hear because they speak english as well ashley is a lawyer but she currently runs a real estate company called ashley white estates in washington dc Hi, I'm Ashley White with TTR Sotheby's International Realty in Washington, D.C. Welcome to 4516 Argyle Terrace Northwest. Let's take a look. She runs a non-profit organization called Project Safe Heaven which inspires hope for single mothers and battered women through housing and training to foster independence and overall quality in life. Here is a video of Ashley on her birthday spending time with her family in Jamaica. Ashley is a lover of God. Of course, our brother cannot settle for less when it comes to that. There are a lot of videos where she was talking about God and encouraging people to stay and trust God. Let's just listen to Family, that. Family, I hope you all are doing well. Um, I wanted to jump on here and just let you know that God hasn't forgot about you. He hasn't forgotten about your purpose. He hasn't forgotten about what you're called to do on this earth. But there is something you have to do and it's called sacrifice. And you need to sacrifice the desire to be on the stage Ask God to tear down that stage that you feel like you need to be on in order to serve. The stage is something that I think that the devil tries to use people into believing that that's the only way that you can be used. And if you're not on that stage, you're not at the magnitude that that person is higher up. Jesus was came as a servant to serve. We are servants. And understand that when you start uh, romanticizing and idolizing the stage, you need to begin to repent for pride and ask God to tear down that stage and to give you a true repentant heart and a heart to serve truly because that's where all of the impact is happening. People who are truly called to serve and with that, the stage looks different from everybody. So I hope that blesses someone. Be blessed and um, I'll see you guys soon. Ashley is also a lover of sports. Here is a video where she was wrestling. A few weeks back, she did her bridal shower in America and currently she's in Nigeria preparing for her wedding. Ashley used to be a model and a lot of people are asking questions why she would dress like this, you know, someone that is getting married to our brother Teofilos. There are a lot of people asking questions why she has to open her body. Is she a slave queen or a body for Christ? Online in-laws are not having it because why will our Teofilos wife be dressed like this? Anyway, Ashley is a good Christian and she preaches the gospel. Um, <laughs> I want to talk about boldness. I spent a long period of time always thinking about what people may think if I am just this radical person for Jesus and um, would people think I'm crazy how do I 
how do I maneuver through this on my social media pages and in person? Just ask God for it. Just ask God for the boldness and you will stop caring. I have been asking God to make me unashamed and bold and I cannot stop being bold. I am praying for people to be healed in the grocery store. A Muslim converted to Christianity like two or three days ago. Um, when you ask God for something with all your heart, he hears you and he is giving his people the strength to be bold in this hour. Die to self so that you can live again. That's what I heard in prayer today. And that's what I want to share with you. What are some things that you're holding on to that you don't want to let go of? God is saying, let go of your idols. Give it to me. In order for you to live forever in him, you are going to have to die to yourself and to the things of this world that you are holding on to. You're not missing out. And as soon as you do that, God will give you everything that you want times 10. The things that you're holding on to is nothing compared to what he has for you. But you have to trust him and you have to release everything that you're holding on to that's keeping you from getting to the promise. These are a few things we know about brother Theophilus' wife to be Ashley. We are so excited for them. May God bless their home and continue to touch lives through their ministry. We are looking forward to lots and lots of amazing content from this love story. So stick to the channel because it's going to rain on this channel. If you have not subscribed, now is the opportunity to subscribe to the channel. And I will see you all in my next one. Bye guys.